Hi friends welcome to AKS Talks. Today I got two updates on space-related topic. The Indian Space Research Organization on Thursday marked its second successful mission of the year, and the second update is, scientists detected radio emissions from an alien world. First let us look into ISRO. Under this pandemic situation our prestigious scientists worked hard for this successful mission and the satellite is functioning very well. The communication satellite is envisaged for providing services in extended C-band of the frequency spectrum covering India, Andaman and Nicobar and Lakshadweep Islands. It is the 42nd communication satellite of the Space Agency. PSLV C-50 is the 22nd flight of PSLV in XL configuration, and it was the 77th launch vehicle mission from Sriharikota. Hats off to our scientists and it is the pride moment of India. Coming to radio emissions from an alien world. Scientists think they've detected radio emissions from an alien world. They may have detected radio emissions from a planet orbiting a star beyond our sun for the first time said Jake Turner, an astronomer at Cornell University. However, Turner and his colleagues are not sure that the signal they detected really is coming from the planet, called as, Tau Boudis B. Also the researchers are interested in detecting radio emission from planets because such information may help scientists decipher what's happening in the same world's magnetic fields. Those magnetic fields, in turn, influence conditions on the surface of the exoplanet. Earth's magnetic field protects the atmosphere that makes the world one we can survive, for example. Such magnetic fields can also tell scientists about other qualities of a world, like its structure and history. But so far, studying those magnetic fields directly has been difficult for scientists to manage, despite the fact that nearly every planet in our solar system has had one at some point in its history. Hence the interest in using radio emissions as an intermediate. We learned from our own Jupiter what this kind of detection looks like, Turner said. We went searching for it and we found it. But that's just the beginning of the story, not the end of it, he emphasized, since the radio emissions could still be coming from the stars or another source instead of the planet. There remains some uncertainty that the detected radio signal is from the planet. The need for follow-up observations is critical. That's all about the two interesting updates. Stay tuned for more space news at AKS Talks. Bye.